to the vlog so what's the plan for today i'm heading out now uh for an hour on my own so then i'm going to come back into the city and uh, meet up with a group do about three three or four hours with the group and then depending on how well my legs are feeling i might go and do another hour on my own for me now it's just a case of getting the miles in before i have to go home because i know as soon as i go back to england it's going to be cold it's going to be wet and it's just not going to be as easy to do the big mile like it would be here there's a little bit of mist around this morning visibility isn't that great but it's supposed to clear in about an hour or so that's the first hour completed i'm just riding back into uh, into the city now to meet up with a group i hardly ever go out with a group uh mainly because I just quite enjoy training on my own and a lot of the time I've got intervals to complete and you can't really do intervals when you're riding with a group. They just get pissed off. But like today I've just got a long endurance ride so it's good to go out with a group. You've got a bit of company, someone to talk to and it just makes those long rides just a little bit more interesting. Your heart beat fills your mouth real But it's not real We were close to see the sun And that's about all the filming that I did today. I've just come down to the river. There's steps here which you can walk down and come right down onto the river. But uh, anyway, I did like five and a half hours today, uh, 158 kilometers, 97 or 98 miles, but I did next to no filming. Uh, there's a couple of reasons why. The, the first reason, uh, the first reason was it, it was a hard ride. We were going hard up climbs and, and constantly pressing on and it was just hard to take the camera out, you know, and it was just hard, hard to film generally. It was a hilly route and on all the hills we were going hard up them. But the second and Probably the main reason why I didn't film today was because uh, Georgia, my girlfriend who you all know, who was here in Girona actually, like two days ago, she had to go back to go to university. Uh, without going into too much detail, she, she woke up this morning and uh, she was having problems, which again, I'm not gonna go into because it's not really my place to say. Long story short, she she was uh, she was admitted into hospital and I got I got told this news like an hour into the ride. And to be honest with you, like my, my mind was just somewhere else today. I was just worrying for Georgia and there wasn't a lot I could do. Like I was in the middle of nowhere, out on my bike. Uh, th there was not a lot I could do in that in that moment. But filming and, and vlogging wasn't the top of my priorities at that moment. I, I, I just wasn't in the, the right state of mind. I, I was worrying for Georgia. I don't really know what else to say about it, but yeah, that's the reason that I didn't really do any filming today. But good news, she is okay. She's out of hospital. Uh, she's back at university. I was gonna scrap off today's vlog completely and just and just not do a vlog today. But I'm so critical of myself. I set myself a challenge of, of, of filming and vlogging uh, and putting up a video every day whilst I'm here in Girona. And I just don't want to break that streak when I'm so close when I'm so close to the end of of my trip. So what I'm gonna do instead is uh, is just answer a couple of questions. Are you still off the coffee? What's the score with the coffee? Uh, yeah. As of yet, I've not drank any coffee since I, I stopped drinking coffee. I'm at the point now where I'm not not drinking it. I've just not like been to the cafe and just not had the reason to drink the coffee. I decided to stop drinking coffee as a little bit of an experiment to see how my body reacted to it. Uh, it it's, it's not really changed anything. I haven't noticed any positives or any negatives uh, with stopping drinking coffee. So yeah, I'm, I'm gonna start drinking it again. Maybe tomorrow, maybe the day after, whenever I feel like it. Hello. <laughs> hey. <laughs> the dogs interrupted my Q&A. Are you looking forward to going back home? Uh, yes and no. I'm looking forward to going back and see, seeing my family, uh, seeing my girlfriend, and uh, seeing, seeing my two dogs, actually, as that dog just walked past. If you've been a long time follower of the vlog, you'll know that I love my two dogs, Sam and Lexi. So I'm really looking forward to seeing them. The final question, this is a good one. Uh, how much money do you make from YouTube? Now, I've only just really started YouTube. I've only just started this whole, this whole, journey and last month I got like 150,000 views 
there's another dog. Which in, in YouTube terms isn't that much, so I didn't make Please don't bite me. 150,000 views isn't really that much money, maybe like 100 pounds. Uh, you can go onto Social Blade and, and you can see exactly what I make if you wanna, if you wanna know. But for me at this stage in my YouTube career, if you, if you wanna call it that, it's not about making money. I'm just enjoying creating videos and it's been amazing to see the growth recently. I never ever anticipated it. Do you remember I did that Zwift giveaway for 2,000 subscribers? That doesn't seem that long ago at all and I'm already at like nearly 4,000, which is insane. I never expected this. I digress. At the minute for me, it's about putting up videos that I'm proud of, uh, putting up videos that I enjoy and, you know, building a viewer base. Like, I'm going to be real with you now. I got an email the other day off um, a new company and basically what they were what they were wanting me to do was to put my videos onto their platform which is a a subscription based platform essentially it's charging people to watch my videos and i actually i actually laughed at this email they were wanting me to put my videos onto their platform and charge you guys to watch my videos let me let me be real with you my videos always have been and always will be free Simple as that. Man, I'm not gonna make you pay to watch my videos. That's just, that's just ridiculous. But that's gonna be the end of the vlog. I know you're gonna be able to understand the circumstances today. It just was one of those days. So I just wanna say a massive, massive thank you to everyone who's been a part of this journey with me so far. Whether you've been here from 200 subscribers, whether you've been here from 500, 1,000, whether you're my most recent subscriber. Just knowing that you're on this journey with me is, is awesome. Back to the regularly scheduled vlog tomorrow.